Hey everybody, in this video I'm showing you how to set up visual voicemail on Visible for both iPhone and Android users. I will be using an iPhone for this example, but I'll also include the steps you can follow if you're on Android. The first step is to open the phone dialer application, and if you go to the voicemail tab in the bottom right, you'll see a message that says, to retrieve a voicemail, first set a password and greeting. And what iPhone users are gonna do is they're gonna tap set up, and this is gonna walk you through the process. Now, if you're on Android, all you're gonna do is go to your keypad, press and hold the one key, and this will call your voice mailbox. In English, press one. Para escuchar las opciones del buzón de mensajes en español, oprima el dos. And all you're gonna do is follow those prompts to set up your voicemail on Android. Now, back to iPhone, I'm just gonna tap set up. I'm going to create a voicemail password. Um, feel free to use whatever you want to use. Uh, it looks like I can do just those four digits and I'll do those again. Done. Now my password has been set for my visual voicemail. Invisible will send you a text message to let you know your voicemail password was changed. It is important to keep that password in mind because you need it to access your voicemail. The next step is to set your personal greeting. You can use the default greeting, which basically just reads out your phone number. Nine, four, six is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you've finished recording, you may hang up or press 1 for more options. Or you can set a custom greeting. To set a custom greeting, select custom and then tap record. And this is where you're going to be actively recording your custom greeting. You can see the little bar there. And when you're done recording, you can press stop. Now, of course, I did a terrible job. It'll just play back what I just said, but we can play that. Record. And this is where you're going to be actively recording your custom greeting. And there you go. So to actually record one, I'm just gonna tap record. You can re-record these at any time if you wanna do it again or say something different. So I'll, I'll do an actual one now. And when you're satisfied, all you're gonna do is tap save. And that will save your personal greeting and your voicemail box is set up. Now again, on Android, all you're doing is you're pressing and holding one to call your voicemail box. Press pound. And because I have my password set, I'm gonna enter that now and I'm gonna press pound. You have no new messages in your mailbox. To change your personal options, press 4. To disconnect, press personal options. To change your password, press 1. Personal greeting, press 3. To change the language, press 5. Your greeting has been recorded as... If you are satisfied with your greeting, press pound. If you would like to re-record your greeting, press star. To replay your greeting, press 1. At the tone, record your greeting. At the end of your greeting, press pound. If you are satisfied with your greeting, press pound. If you would like to re-record your greeting, press star. To replay your greeting, press 1. Personal options. To change your password, press 1. Personal greeting. And there you go. Your visual voicemail is now set up on Visible. You can tap to preview your messages. You can play them. You get a transcription on iPhone. And I think you also get it on Android in some cases, especially if you're using a Pixel. You can trash a message. You can share it. Uh, you can tap the edit button here to select messages, you can delete them, you can mark them as red, um, and yeah, you get basically a lot of options and cool features that make it more convenient for previewing your voicemail messages, seeing who called you, and giving you the quick option to get back to them, because you can just tap the call button there. Either way, that's been it for this video. Click the like button if you found it helpful. Huge shout out to these Patreon supporters. I really appreciate your support, allowing me to test out different cell phone plans for you guys. And make sure you're subscribing if you want to save money on your cell phone bill. That's it for this video. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Peace.